Hello, welcome to the RS10 Fitness Zoom studio. It's a little space. Uh, we're back with some incredible news. We're open, we're back in the gym as of Wednesday, the 2nd of December, with all of our classes and our in person fitness happening here. The last month has been great seeing you guys online at home, but we're super excited to get back in the gym. With that in mind, we'll put some updates about the classes and the timetable for those first few days that are open again. Yes, guys. Um, so yeah, just reconfirming, we're open again on the second. Okay, so that means on the second we're gonna run a full day of fitness. We're gonna add in an extra class in the morning as well, so 7:30 a.m. Just try and give you as many chances as possible to get in, train, see everyone again, and be merry for this. Coming up to Christmas, isn't it? That is lovely. Yeah. Um, on the Thursday, on that note as well, so the day after, uh, the third of December. Um, See, that's usually our limited day where we're a little bit quieter. We want again to add, you know, get you in, get you training again. So we're going to add a run, or run a full day of fitness again on that day as well. So all your usual classes, 6 a.m., uh, 9.30, uh, 4 o'clock, 5.15, 6.45 and 8. It's a lot of numbers. It's a lot of numbers. Number one. Good news for you. It will all be on Team Up by the end of today. So you can see exactly where the classes are. You can get yourselves booked in by end of this week ready to go for those opening days on Wednesday and those extra classes on Thursday. Yeah, exactly. Um, obviously on Thursdays is usually a day that yours truly will be running like the barbell slot. For that week we're just going to let it slide for that week um, and we're going to reintroduce it on the week after. So for the week of the 7th um, it will just be a run, running a full week as we usually would do and as you usually would expect. So barbell will be making a reappearance on that week. Couple of bits from me. Um, Christmas hours are also going to float up on Team Up in the next couple of days, so you can keep an eye out for those. I'll let you know when they're up. Um, as we get back into the gym, and I think as we move towards this potential vaccine solution that we're looking at, I think it's going to be very easy for our social distancing to get lapsed when we're out and about generally and when we're in the gym. And we need to make a big conscious effort inside the gym to stay on top of what we're doing. So, we as coaches are working really hard to make sure that. You guys are giving the opportunity to social distance when you're getting equipment out and putting it away again. And with that in mind, if we could ask you to stay outside the gym until the previous class is finished. If you want to come in five minutes early and get warmed, that's still fine. But if the other class is still working out, please don't float in any earlier than you need to. Uh, and at the end of your class, if you want to hang around and chat for five minutes before you leave, also fine. But do it in the big space here rather than by the shutter. When you make your way over to the shutter to leave, it should just be a case of grabbing your bag and getting out. We don't want to hang around in that space because it is the smallest part of the gym, so that would be the, the worst place for us all to stand at the same time. Uh, I'm sure I've got something else on my list. No, I haven't, except the one-way system, which will obviously still be operations. When you do arrive, as always, in through the office, out through the shutter door, let's try and give ourselves as much opportunity to stay away from each other as much as we can. Otherwise, we are so excited to have you guys back in the gym as of the second. It's been great seeing you at home, but it's not quite the same. No, it's not, is it? So, oh, um, wait, guys. Yeah, buzzing. Thanks for watching, see you soon, toodles bye.